I'm black. I collect anime, so get used to it. What's up, y'all? Beat Dub the Anime Master is back for anime DVD reviews. Today I'm going to be reviewing Tenshi Muyo GXP DVD box set. That's right, the original 2006 Tenshi Muyo GXP box set by Funimation Entertainment. Now this series is a spinoff of the Tenshi Muyo Rio Oki OVAs. And this is basically like a, um, a sequel to Tenshi Muyo Rio Oki OVA 3. Everything that happens in this series takes place one year after Tenshi Muyo Rio Oki OVA 3. So after you watch the third OVA, you watch this. You know, you watch OVA 1, 2, 3, then this. So uh, let's get started. I'm going to show the packaging first. The standard Funimation Entertainment uh, brick. Not brick, but um, art box. Right? This is an art box. Funimation doesn't really do these box sets anymore because I guess they're kind of expensive to produce. So yeah, four volumes. Oh, hold on. As you can see, uh, yeah, four volumes. Volume 1, each volume has two discs, the series is on 8 DVDs, the old anime fashion packaging, 8 discs, 26 episodes, 8 fucking discs, disc 2, I mean uh, volume 2, Volume 3. And Volume 4. This is the art box, this is the inside, which is nothing. The front, the side, and the back. When you put all of this together, it comes this image of the main character, Santa Yamato. And now let's get to the synopsis of Tenshi Muyo GXP. Tenshi Muyo GXP starts off with the main character, Santa Yamato. Remember, as I said earlier, it takes place one year after the original Tenshi Muyo Ryo Oki OVA 3. So, Santa Yamada is 14, 15 years old. He has a hardcore string of bad luck. One day, his bad luck changes when a spaceship comes crashing down. And he meets this woman. Her name is Amani Kalnak. Amani gives him this GXP pamphlet to sign him up for the GXP. GXP meaning Galaxy Police. He talks to his family about it, he talks to his friends about it, and he decides to go ahead on his good space-like adventure. Throughout the adventure, Santa, Santa Yamana comes across Kiriko, and he comes across a whole lot of a slew of other hilarious Tenshi Muyo characters. Mitoto, which is Mihoshi's, uh, I think, mother. Uh, Tenshi, all the rest, the rest of the gang appears. Uh, Serio Tainan, the, the most funniest character, I believe, in the series. It's a, it's a, it is, it is a, uh, basically a spinoff of the, of the Tenshi Muyo franchise, you know, kind of show the different sides, different characters and stuff. The main Tenshi cast, you know, Tenshi, Ryoko, Aika, only show up in one episode, and they don't have their original English dub voices. In the Japanese version, they do have their original voices. English, they don't, which is kind of sad. Sad, but I understand the reason why they couldn't get them back for that one episode. At least they came back for the Tenshi Muyo OVA 3, except for Ryoko's voice actress. But anyway, uh, Tenshi Muyo GXP is a funny series, lots of fan service, lots of action, comedy. It does drag and slow down a little bit, but the ending does pay off. It has a satisfying ending, so you know, check it out if you're a Tenshi Muyo fan. I give this series a 7 out of 10. But the reason why I give it a 7, the DVDs 
uh, Arthur pretty terribly for Funimation. And I know these DVDs are pretty old. So yeah, the DVD offering is, is bad when you watch it on a high definition TV. On a standard definition television, it's okay. But on my TV, the DVDs kind of look like shit. But I can, I can deal with it, you know. And uh, the story is kind of, you know, wishy-washy. And the, the plot is kind of everywhere once it gets into the later episodes. So that's why I give it a 7. It's not the best tension movie or spinoff. But I definitely would like to watch this over and over again if that's a third OVA, which I'll be reviewing very soon. So this is BW the Anime Master, and that was my review for Tenchi Muyo GXP. Peace.